So we've all seen those fold them up. They look like tin foil on one side, cardboard on the other. You stick them under the uh, sun visors on the inside of your car. Okay, guess what? They don't really work that well. Sun still creeps through. They make your car dark and that's about it. It still gets hot in there, right? So what can we do? Because in the summer, the heat is so intense in a closed car. I mean, and quickly too. You know, you always hear all the warnings about don't leave your kids in a closed car, your pets in a closed car. We all know not to do that. But what about the car itself? What about the dashboard? What about those, maybe you forgot and left your GPS plugged in in there or your cell phone? All of those electronic uh, contraptions say do not leave in direct sunlight because heat will harm Harm those things. Things melt in a car. How about when you got to run in and your groceries are in the car? Don't you want to keep your car cool? Leaving this in the windshield for one hour makes your car 55% cooler. Leaving this in your windshield makes your car 20 degrees cooler. And all you got to do is pop it onto the outside of your windshield, which is where the heat source starts. Heating up that glass heat radiating into your car. This deflects it. It doesn't even get through the glass and your car stays cool. We have three colors and two sizes for you today. We have the blue, we have the platinum, and we have the gold. And we also have it for you in either the standard or the extra large size. We'll show you the, the different silhouettes of cars, but for the most part, oh, here it comes. For the most part, unless you've got a big old truck like me and Dan Hughes, or you've got a large minivan or a full size SUV like a Ford Expedition, that's the XL. Pretty much everybody else is going to get the standard size. Yep. So pick a color, get one for every car you own, and you'll be very, very pleased with the result. All right, here comes our friend Scotty Hine. These are such a better mousetrap, as we say. You know what I love about it the most? Is it was designed by you, the viewer. Mm -hmm. For you, by you. Because the over, over a million of you that called in and bought the Frost Garden were so very appreciative. But so many of you said, do you have, can I use this for the sun? Can I frost use my guard? frost guard no, in the summer? You absolutely no, absolutely not. It unfortunately, does not work that way because it's, it's, it's not okay, again, it's, it's like It's like putting the cardboard thing in your window for the summertime. Does it Because all it does is keep your car kind of dark. It doesn't do anything about the heat. This is for the heat. <laughs> so when we said, no, you can't use your frost guard, like, okay, then can you make something that does work? Yes. And we did. And the beautiful thing about it is, is that it's scientifically proven. We went to an independent test lab, mm -hmm. and they told us that this can cool your car up to 55% cooler in one hour. That's how effective Isn't that this amazing? is. It's an amazing, it's one of the most amazing, like legally approved statistics I've ever said. Anyone I've told that to, they're like, holy mackerel. Yeah. 55% in one hour, super easy to use, super effective from a name and a company you've known and trusted and it's been real popular. So this works if you if you put it on overnight and it's it's out there in the morning as your car starts to heat up. It also works if your car's already hot That's and you it. put this on, it's gonna cool it down. 55% in an hour. It also, when you wear this on your windshield, as I like to say, because my car is a girl, when she wears this <laughs> on her windshield, she stays 20 degrees cooler. Well, that's a big deal. That's, that's a big huge. Deal. I mean, that's the difference between 90 degrees and 70 degrees. 70 degrees might be tolerable when you first sit down before you get your air conditioning on. Sure. 90 degrees, not so much. That's like take your breath away hot. That's burning your hands on the steering wheel. That's burning your legs on the seat, even through your pants. Yeah. And you know, you're asking your children to sit in a hot car like that before the air conditioning gets on. My husband and I have a joke. The second we get into a hot car, he says to me, doesn't this thing have air conditioning? And I always <laughs> say, well, not unless the motor's running. Right. So, you know, but it takes a few minutes That's to get it cooled thing. down, right? How many of you turn your car on 15 minutes before you get into it to turn the AC on? Mm -hmm. Well, it's a huge waste of gas. It beats up your AC. It's just not good in general. Mm -hmm. So why not put this on mm -hmm. and have it on at any time of day and then the beautiful thing is, he it cools your car up to 55%, but guess what? Here we are in May, yeah. right? We've already had 90s across the country. Yeah. Every single state in the union got up to 90 at some point in time last summer. Mm -hmm. No reason to think that won't happen again this yeah. year. So keep your car cool and keep it easy. That's what I love, so simple. So how does it work? What do I do when I yep. get it out of the box? 
great question. Comes right out of the box, ready to go, no assembly whatsoever. It's a 150D polyester, so it can take an absolute beating, okay. but it fits on nice and snug. It's washable, okay. which is great, but here's the key. You've got a fit fast system with this uh, fiberglass rod right here, so it can be adjusted to any side view mirror on any car, truck, or SUV in the market today. Neoprene sleeve, fits nice and snug it's like a little over. oven mitt that it's goes exactly over your rear is. your side view mirrors less than 15 seconds i like 15 seconds way better than i like 15 minutes of running your car yes. and your air conditioning mm -hmm. and for those of you with pets or little ones you know within a car seat there's nothing worse than putting your pet your child into a blazing hot car yeah. you see the dog i mean you're right obviously away. we know you guys aren't leaving your pets in the car no, of or leaving not. your kids in the car surely not but even getting into getting the into car, it is what I meant. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, and sometimes you don't have time to go out and turn on the air conditioning and then you know go get everybody in. Maybe you're coming out of the veterinary office with your dog on a leash and your car's so hot, you've been in there for an hour and now your doggy's got to get in the car before the air conditioning cranks in. He's panting. He's right away. So it's hot. Horrible. It's horrible. So, but it'll be 20 degrees cooler with this thing on your windshield. Yeah, and, and the big story here is I love this this demonstration to show you what the difference and using okay. a solar guard, not using a solar mm -hmm. guard. So here what we have, we have from Phoenix, Arizona, and, and you can see maybe over there you can't, but this is from last Tuesday, May 12th. So this newspaper is only a week old. Here's the pristine one. Here's the one that we sat in a car dashboard Yikes. for five days in Phoenix. Look what the difference was just in those five days. Wow. Now this is a dramatization. So we're not saying that you're going to see necessarily this fading or this yellowing, but what I can tell you is this. The solar guard itself will block nearly all of the UVA rays and the uh, visible light from going through your windshield. Yeah. And we know those rays and we know that light does cause yellowing, does cause fading, does and cause cracking. damage, all kinds of terrible you know, things. Look, you, know, you spend a lot of money on your car, and even if it's not a brand new car, you want to keep it looking nice as long as possible. You don't want damage to your dashboard, to your steering wheel, to your upholstery due to the sun shining through. And you know, this attacks it at the point of attack. This prevents it from the outside from getting through into your windshield. This is nothing, not even in the same category as those folding cardboard things. It's not even close. That, that you put inside your windshield. It's not the same thing. Those don't work very well. But before we bought them because there was no other choice. Sure. Now you have a better choice. And you know why they don't work well? Because there's gaps. Plus yeah. the heat has already gotten into your car. Yeah. This stops the light in the heat at the point of attack, mm -hmm. and I can show you that, actually. Okay. So what we have here is inside the car, we mm -hmm. have a camera, okay? And that camera, and if you would pull that back just a little sure. bit for uh -huh. me, the camera's shooting out into the studio lights. You see those bright studio lights, but I'm going to make it even worse. I'm going to take a 2800 lumens, a super bright spotlight. I'm gonna shine it in the car here to sort of represent the sun, but this isn't nearly as bad as the sun. Mm -hmm. Now, if you would hand me back over that, watch this, when I slide the solar guard back over, it reduces all of that light Look at that. down to about the size of a coaster. Oh my was gosh. There oh my goodness, to what's here wow. now. That's how it prevents the heat and the light. And all of that, those rays, all mm -hmm. of that heat that comes in, mm -hmm. that can heat your car up to 40 degrees. Yeah. So what we did, Carolyn, is we took this to an independent accredited lab to get it tested. We created two similar glass chambers to represent the inside of a cabin of a car. We covered one with a solar guard, left one uncovered. In just one hour, the uncovered chamber went up to about 85 degrees. The, the, I'm sorry, the covered went up to 85 degrees. The uncovered went up to a staggering 106 degrees in one hour. Now, the, do you see that that is 21 degrees hotter? 55% cooler in one hour. And wow. you think about it, what's an hour? That's yeah. a shopping trip. Yeah. That's just good That's parking. That's a doctor appointment. It's a doctor appointment. Yeah. That's an hour is nothing. 55% mm -hmm. cooler in mm -hmm. an hour. And because here's why it stops the light rays, the UVA, the heat at the point of attack. You see Kylie here. She's putting this on a Ford Escape, Carolyn. Easy to use, easy to install. Neoprene sleeve goes over any side view mirror out there. Fits nice and snug. And look at that coverage over that windshield. Fit fast system allows it to, to fit nice and easy. Now, then, uh, next, ahead, next, I was just going to say, if you're wondering about what size to get, we'll go over that in just a second. But behind Kylie is a big truck. So she's got the standard size on the car and or the smaller SUV, and she's got the XL size on the truck. Uh, you don't need to go up to that XL size unless you've got a full size SUV or a, a full size pickup truck or a 
large minivan because this adjusts. So if you get the standard size, it's going to fit everything from like a Mini Cooper mm -hmm. all the way up to a Lexus sedan mm -hmm. or, you know, a smaller SUV. So it, it's really adjustable. So most of you are probably going to pick up the standard. Yeah. Um, but some of you who have a very large vehicle, like I've got the big truck, like Dan has the big truck, we're going to get the XL for that vehicle. And so, if I could, Carolyn, real quick. Yes. What I've said to people all day is if you're like at a Ford Explorer and yeah. up, get the XL. Kay. If you're at a Honda CRV, Ford Escape and down, Kay. get the standard. Good but if point. you can shade up, it's not that big a deal. Yeah. Not like it was with the Frost Card. Okay. Yeah. So let's say hi to C in Pennsylvania. Hi, C. How are you? Fine, thank you. Nice to have you on the hey, show. Hey. Does this look like a good mm. idea? It's great because I have the inside fold one yeah. to Ugh. my Mercedes, and this I won't have to worry about trying to get the mirror to adjust. Yeah, right. And yep. then they kind of flop down a little bit, and a lot of that sun does still get through those things. Yes, it does. Yeah. And my thing is, I have a question. Yes, ma'am. Shoot. Does it come down to the vent? Or will it be above the vent? Great you know, question. The windshield wiper you mean right vent? down here? Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. And, and, yeah. and that's on a car by car basis. And I wish I had a more specific answer for you. On some cars, it absolutely does, and others, it may not. So I, I, unfortunately, I don't have a specific answer. I'm sorry. Oh, that's okay. This is good. It's, it looks fantastic. I'm trying one, and I'm getting one for my mother. Excellent. Excellent. I've been using mine for two weeks, and I utterly yeah. love it. And what color are you getting for your cars? I got silver for yeah. both of the cars. Mm -hmm. Great. I um, would wanted to try the blue, but I said it may stand out too much, so I got the silver. The silver's been very popular. Um, and then yeah. everyone can see we also have the gold and the blue one. So it's totally up to your personal choice. But see, thank you for trying these. Please let us know what you think. I sure will. Thank right. you so much. Hey, take have care. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Bye -bye. Thank you so much, Sid. Um, let me just reset really quickly, and then we'll show you some sizing. This is our today's special value. I'm just going to walk right over here. This is from the folks who brought you the Frost Guard, which we sold thousands upon thousands upon thousands of during the winter season to protect your windshield from getting uh, frost on it so you don't have to scrape it. Everybody loved that idea. Folks were saying, but what about the summer? Can I use my Frost Guard to keep my car from getting hot? No, because it doesn't have a heat deflector, a sun deflector on it. It's just to protect the surface. This is the Solar Guard, the worldwide launch from the same people who brought you the Frost Guard. This is going to protect your car from heat. It's going to keep your car 55% cooler in an hour. It's going to keep your car 20 degrees cooler as well. It's also going to protect the surfaces inside your car from getting cracked and damaged from sunlight and heat. It's also going to protect things like your, your tablets and your GPS and stuff that you accidentally leave in the car and not supposed to get hot. I've ruined more than one cell phone by it being sure. melted in the sun. Sure. Uh, this is also going to prevent you from getting into a scorching hot car and burning your legs or burning your hands on the steering wheel or your poor kids, grandkids and pets from having to get into a hot car and wait for the air conditioning to kick in because this is going to keep it at a comfortable 20 degrees cooler level even before the air conditioning turns on. So we have it for you in blue. They're all this wonderful lightweight, it almost feels like a parachute oh, kind of a so material. Oh, yeah, like a lightweight tag, um, yeah. This one, nothing on here, by the way, is going to scratch any surface of your car. Mm -hmm. Not the bars on the side, nothing's going to scratch. Don't worry by, to put this on your car. Here's blue, here's silver, and here's gold. Now, Scott, let's quickly talk about what size should I get. Sure, and, and it's, it's, it's real simple. I mean, if you have a sedan or compact car, no brainer, get yourself a standard. If you have a midsize SUV, and what we're talking about here is like a Volkswagen Tiguan, a, a Ford Escape, a Honda CRV, then stay on the standard. If you're like a Ford Explorer and up, a Buick Enclave, get then the, the XL. And if you're anywhere in the pickup truck area, if you're in a van area, mm -hmm. a large minivan, Honda Odyssey, mm -hmm. go ahead and get yourself an XL just to be sure. And again, if it is a little, a little over the side of the window, it's not like the Frost Guard. If it is over a little bit, it's really okay. Okay. And I think what's so great about this is, is just the technology and the mm -hmm. idea. I know it's new and I know you haven't seen it, but it's so effective because it stops the UVA, it stops the heat, it stops the light rays at the source. It stops them at the windshield. They never they, make it in They're not going to get in in the they first place. They never get in. So they just bounce back off. Look, here's the little mitten. Here's the little, <laughs> I call this the oven mitt. Um, you know, you're going to place this on top of your windshield. This is a very flexible bar right here yep. that can move and stretch to fit whatever windshield size you have. And then these poles. See how I'm pulling this? I'm just pulling it under my side mirror and just placing it over. 
So, by the way, that stays on securely. If it's windy, that's oh, yeah. not going to come popping off. Yeah. Because this is tight. This stretches tight over your windshield and stays in place. Yeah, and what I like to use it for is my daughter, for example. She mm -hmm. plays field hockey and soccer. Okay, mm -hmm. so we've told you all day that this reduces the heat in your car, makes it cooler by 55% in one hour. You know what one hour is? A soccer game, yeah. a field hockey game, mm -hmm. a, a football, any kind of a game. So you sit it out there in the park or the field where you're going, you cover it up, right. and in that hour, the last thing you want is for your kid to come off the field or your pet to come off the field and get into a blazing hot car right. when they're already warm. Exactly. So keep it 55% cooler in that same hour you're out in the field and you're good to go. By the way, something we haven't even mentioned is um, obviously when you're going to get in the car, you're going to put your air conditioning on. Guess what also now works more efficiently and faster? Your mm. air conditioning. Absolutely. Because your car is not as hot to begin with. <laughs> so you're not using up all that extra gasoline with your air conditioner on longer while you're sitting there trying to get the car cool. So it's just better for your car. It's better for you. We, you know, we live in places that get hot part of the year, at least some of us, part of the year, it gets really hot. This protects from the heat, just like your frost guard protected from the ice made by the same people. This is a great product and we're launching it today. This is exclusive to QVC until July. You cannot get it anywhere else for any price. C get it here. If it's anything like the Frost Guard, and by the way, over 28,000 already ordered today. If we run out of these, you can't yeah. get one somewhere else. Yeah, it's not so yeah. get it now <laughs> while true. we have the color you want and the size you want. And for folks who have more than one vehicle, everybody's getting one for every vehicle they own. My absolute favorite way to demonstrate what kind of damage and what the kind of power the sun has is mm -hmm. right here. So we took these two newspapers. This was last Tuesday's newspaper, May 12th from Phoenix, Arizona. And what we have here is the original pristine newspaper. And then this is one we put in a car in Phoenix for five days, just five days, yeah. okay? Now this is a dramatization and we're not saying you'll see the same fading and yellowing, but what we are saying is the UVA rays, the, the visible light rays that come into your car, they cause yellowing, they cause fading. This blocks nearly all of those rays. Yeah. So what I can tell you is it's a real good thing for your car and your car's interior to have this on the windshield. Yeah, and it protects the stuff that's in your car that you leave in your car, like your CD case, your CDs, your, your GPS, all that stuff that's not supposed to get super hot because now it protects it from light damage and heat damage by keeping your car 55% cooler and 20 degrees cooler. Uh, let's say hi to Connie in Ohio. Hi, Connie. I hear you are a fan of your frost guards. Is that yes, right? Yes, I am. That's I bought good. three in the winter. Yeah. And uh, oh, thank my daughter you. and granddaughter and myself, we love it. Oh, good. This is going to be just as easy to use, Connie. I'm so glad. And you, I bet you don't like getting into a really hot car, do you? No, I don't think anyone does. Yeah. And, you know, this will keep it, at, it's not going to keep it cool like your air conditioning's on, but right. it'll keep it tolerable yeah. until you can get the air conditioning going. Right. Yeah, I'm so glad they came out with this. It looks really, really easy to use, and uh, the Frost Guard was wonderful. Oh, good. Well, it's the same folks behind both ideas, and actually, they created this because of our QVC customers saying, yeah. what am I going to do in the summer? You know, Right. Well, that's mm -hmm. wonderful. I'm glad they did. Mm -hmm. And Connie, I'll tell you what, I've been here at QVC for almost 13 years now. I've never seen anything like this. You are now, I would say, maybe the 20th caller, maybe 25th caller we've had today. Every single one of our wonderful callers has said, I owned the Frost Guard, I loved it, that's why I bought this, and we're mm -hmm. so very appreciative. I really mean that because we work hard to make you happy, we listen to you, this is why we bought it. So thank you for continuing to about a thousand. I appreciate it. Thanks, Connie. Thank you so much. Enjoy. And you both have a blessed, wonderful and, day. Oh, you, you too. And you Thanks, have a Connie. wonderful summer, Connie. Thank yes, you. Yes, you too. Thanks, dear. Bye-bye. Thank well. you so much. Yeah. Thank Bye -bye. you. So uh, again, there's blue, which by the way is the color Connie bought. Uh, we also have silver, which has been very popular. And as you can see in the front, we also have gold. Uh, totally up to your personal choice. Let's do that demonstration uh, with that high beam spotlight again. So I say this makes a phenomenal gift. Mm -hmm. One for every car, one for your graduate, one for you know your father for Father's Day. Here's why. Here's the it, studio lights. Yep. Now you can see those are pretty bright. Blocks nearly all of we, the UVA and visible lights. We've going got in, a camera inside out. the car, yep. so pretend you were sitting in your car. That's what you would see. Now look at, look at this, this bright, bright light. light. Now if you slide that back over to me, I want you okay. to check this out. Now here's look the difference. What, yeah, well look at the difference. Check this out. Goes right across. Wow. That reduces it down to basically a coaster. Wow. I mean look at that. That's from here. Whoa. As bright as, whoa, yeah. bright as it gets. Sorry cameraman. Yeah. To there. Yeah. It is incredible.
incredible. And here's some animation. And here's the thing, when those UVA rays and the visible light comes into the cabin it can, of your car, it can heat it up to 40 degrees. So we took it to an independent test lab to, to prove how effective the solar guard is. What we did is we built two identical glass chambers to simulate the inside of a car cabin. We covered one with a solar guard and left one uncovered. After just one hour, the solar guard chamber, the one covered with solar guard, went up to 85 degrees. Carolyn, the one left uncovered, went up to a staggering 106 Yikes. degrees in one hour. Yeah. That's 55% cooler in your car in one hour by using the solar guard, mm -hmm. and here's why it works. Because all of those rays, all the UVA, the visible light, the heat, gets stopped at the point of attack. Unlike those cardboard pieces of garbage, this stops it from getting in, and your car just does not get as hot. And put the little mitten over the side mirror on either side, stretch it, just kind of adjust a little bit, ta-da. It takes seconds to put this on. It takes seconds to take this off. You, when you take it off, you can just roll it up, fold it up, throw it in the back seat, and then go on your merry way, put it back on when you park. Uh, oh my gosh, and if you are, are not out and about all the time and your car sits in your driveway a lot, oh. um, just leave this on it's all it. the time. It's you it. can leave it on overnight. Or yeah. Is it okay if I leave it on if it rains? Of course, because the okay. beautiful thing is it's washable. That's yeah. a nice thing. Okay. It's durable. It's like a tent material. It takes a beating, uh -huh. and it's easy to use, easy to take on and off. This is really like a 15-second cure mm -hmm. to the 15-minute problem of mm -hmm. trying to turn on your car and your air conditioning. Yeah. You, you take it off and you go. It's easy. And there's no assembly. There's nothing to put together. And uh, you can see Kylie there showing you the two different sizes. Uh, most vehicles are going to take a standard size. If you have a, an extra large vehicle, big truck, big SUV, yeah. uh, and uh, a minivan or some of the larger sedans, yeah. go with the XL. Um, here's how it comes to you all rolled up. This is how you can store it in the on the floor of the back seat of your car, in the trunk, whatever. Um, it's like, you know, like a, if I could twirl a baton, I would. But uh, <laughs> that's, that's the size of it. No assembly get one you'll be so happy you'll be so much more comfortable and your car will stay in better shape too all summer long with our exclusive solar guard thank you scott as i always do I